Hello everyone, my name is Cristian Niculescu and welcome to another episode of uh, Learn Your in 5 Minutes. Today we'll talk about deserialized G JSON. Yeah, so basically we'll have uh, a JSON, we'll have this example, and this example will extract data from this example very fast. Now, to be able to do th this stuff, I have multiple videos on, uh, 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 on my YouTube channel, but now we'll focus on a uh, uh, main uh, experience with this. So, the idea is like this. Um, we need to use uh, something from um, um, json.net. So basically, in query, uh, querying JSON and select token, this is the main function. And uh, here you have another web page where you will see this function. So let's see what uh, we have. So first, uh, first time, we will read the file. So we have the JSON file, we'll read the file, and then we'll say deserialize JSON. Yeah? This deserialized JSON, it's uh, in the package, uh, so you have to install Web API. Yeah, so you have Web API, you install Web API activity, and you'll find the deserialized JSON activity. After you you have the deserialized JSON activity, we need to access the um, the values. So let's see what uh, we'll have. So let's say that uh, here we have a vector with multiple uh, JSON files. So let's say that I want the name from the first one, I want the age from the second one, and I want the, the wage from the uh, third one, or something like this, yeah? So let's see how we do this in new very very fast. So basically here I have um, um, the function, so I have a, a J object, the J, a JSON, uh, this is like JSON, return a JSON object. On the JSON object, I use select token, and I put records, first element, and I get the name, so I'll get John, yeah? Then, um, like I said, I, I want the, uh, the age of the second one and I want the wage of the, the third one, yeah? Good, so if I run it, I have this, um, I will have these values. I will run it and we'll have this, uh, uh, these values display on the output. So on the output, we have John 40 and uh, 50. So you can see John 40 and 50. Yeah, so very easy how to uh, to extract this data. But let's say that we want to add the complex data. Yeah. So if we want to uh, to get complex data, let's say that we want to find something. Yeah. So uh, basically, we'll search on the on the tokens. We will search for the uh, for the Jeff. So we don't know what is the position of the Jeff. So we'll search for the element that has the name Jeff. Yeah, here we have also the command. So if you want to, to search for something, you will say select token um, record and search for the name. You will have all these commands in on GitHub. So on the description on, on the movie on the GitHub, you will have all the uh, all the commands and all the JSON. Yeah. So if you want for the search for the name, if you want for the make a list of all the elements that have an age uh, more than 33 and get the name. So let's see if I want to search. In the records where I have the name, I have to use this function. And if I use this function, and I'll run it, you will see that he will return uh, he will return the uh, the characteristic of Jeff. You see, he return all the characteristics of Jeff. And if I want to return the age, I just put age and convert and extract the age. Then, if I want to make uh, the uh, the list, so I will get a list of the elements that uh, has the age under uh, uh, 23 yeah so i have here the list of elements you see age more than 23 yeah so if i want to uh, to do this stuff i will run it and i will get all the elements that have age more than 23 here this all three are ages uh, higher than uh, 23 uh, let's put the output so you see all the element and John and Tim and Jeff, everyone has the, the age of 23. And the last one, if I want to make a sum of ages, for example, uh, or sum of not uh, wage, not uh, age. So if I want to make the sum of um, um, uh, uh, wage, I make a function. I use here a function and um, uh, this function will make the sum of uh, what I want. I want C deck to be able to convert to, to decimal. Yeah? So I will make this function and make the, the sum of the, uh, the wages. Let's run this one. Um, and here you see the 2,225. Uh, so I have this one with this one, it's only 2,000, uh, two, uh, two, 
2025. Okay, so that's the idea. Uh, you remember in the description of the movie, you find all the search, and these are the two, uh, two websites from where you learn how to extract data very fast from um, JSON. As usual, if you like my movies, please subscribe to my, uh, my channel and um, hit like and comment my movies. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Stay safe.